Circle of Harmony is my invitation to this group of friends. Uh, I was raised and born in Apulia with Apulian roots by learning how powerful hospitality can be. So this is my real message to these friends of mine. It's a message, it's a call for action, it's a call for evolution that I ask to these friends. So it's an exercise that we took over by blending their vision with my vision and working together in harmony, in this circle of harmony, to evolve the Natuzzi DNA. So like every good wine, there is a long process that takes you to blend and, and make the best wine you can. So in this case, our process took months of working together, experiencing together our vision to make great objects and tell great stories. And so this blend tells the great story of our passion, of our value, of our vision and of our creativity. But if you try some time, you might find you get what you need. <laughs> First of all, Fabio is one of the greatest Italian icons of design and architecture. So it was a honor for me to invite him in the Natuzzi family and work together. Secondly, he is a Puglian. His roots are like mine. We share this sense of love for our heritage, for our roots, for what harmony, Apulian harmony teaches us. For what that sense of place and of life, he translated that in his own style, in his own design stylistic. We tried to work together more than once we had many chances to, to share visions and ideas, but this time the wine was, was ready to be served. The blend was great and the taste was amazing. So we decided to go for it and the new classic is, is gonna be a great wine. Human nature. 53 years old, born in Lecce. That's how you can sum it up. But all my life, what I tried to do was to expand my borders. You know, it's like, when I was a kid, I was trying to deny my roots. I was feeling myself a citizen of the planet. I was eventually trying to explore stars, different worlds. I didn't want to belong to something. classic starts from an, from an archetype in uh, sofas, which is the Chesterfield. But it's quite accidental in some ways. I mean, I, I thought about my, my idea of classicity, and this sofa came out in my mind. But then, then of course, the way I approach things is like denying and, and evolving. But for me, for me, it's all the same. I mean, it's like uh, taking chaos and giving order. They all look disconnected. They all look like pieces of a mosaic. But then I give sense to the final image of that mosaic. And you know, it's true, it's the first time I'm working with the company that is from the same place where I was born. And I must tell you, it's beautiful to work in such a situation. I'm not one of those designers of, or architects that want to be remembered forever, not at all. Uh, I just want to design things that are born in a good way and will die in a good way. And under this point of view, which is my idea of sustainability, I fully agree with the, with the approach of Natuzzi. I mean, the way they manufacture things is very proper. Our goal 
as designers and producers is really to, to design and, and to have an idea of how things are born and how they will die. For me, that's a main issue. When, when he told me that the, um, that the main thing of this collection was blending, we were talking and I said to him, you know, you are the best testimonial of this idea of blend. I mean, your mother was American, your father is from the south of Italy. I mean, the blend is in your DNA. Who better than you can testify such an issue, which is, for me, is crucial in the way we face the world, in, in, in the way we want to evolve this world. We've been friends for many years, and, uh, and I think that's the way people should work together. They should appreciate each other. They should love each other. And that's how things come out very nicely, you know? And you see, the reason why I decided that Natuzzi more and more needs to work with poets, not just designer, is this. You know, this man is a talent of creativity, communication, integration, contrast and harmony at the same time. This man represents what I believe design should communicate to the world in the next future, you know? When, when you say design, it's not about design software, it's about the way we approach the world, the way we face everyday problems. You are all designers. You just have to clarify in your mind which are your goals, which are your priorities. We have very clear our priorities. L-O-V-E. Yeah.